Hey everybody, it's Nate and Steph from Adventure in a Backpack. Uh, we have a problem and we need some help figuring it out. Uh, last time we had a little bit of an engine breakdown. We kind of crowdsourced our, our help and it was actually very helpful. Uh, we're like 95% sure what's going on, uh, but ultimately we think we'd like to get some more opinions on the matter. So anyway, we're driving down the road just a, a little bit ago, heard a squealing and then a, um, a belt, you know, basically a belt, a belt just broke. Uh, we knew that much. Yeah. Uh, so anyway, uh, started smoking, all that kind of stuff. Didn't see exactly what was going on, uh, but we were only about a mile from where we were camped. And so we decided just to back up uh, like ASAP basically and get back to the campsite to where we've got a nice little spot to work and sleep if need be kind of thing. Uh, so the belt broke and we're just going to show you guys what's going on with it and uh, see if anybody's got any opinions on the matter at hand. So. Uh, you want to kind of point at things? Yep. Okay, cool. So, okay. So, this came off whenever we were driving, which, let me see if I can get focused on that. Uh, if I can't, it doesn't really matter. What it is, is it's the uh, the pulley for the water housing, the, the, the water pump. Water pump, yep. Can you see it from where you are? Um, no. Okay, so that's the pulley on the front of the uh, the water pump, and it is basically totally destroyed. It's uh, it looks like it's melted actually, uh, but we think the cause is from. Can you see it? Yeah, if you stick that light up in there, I can. Okay, go for it. Okay, so this is the AC compressor, and it is completely seized up. Can't spin that at all. Uh able to move it just a little bit this way. This is clockwise, and that's as far as I can go. It seems like it turns about an eighth of a turn uh, in either direction and then stops. Yeah. Yeah, so that's pretty much completely seized up. Um, um, all the other pulleys uh, are, are, are moving freely. Yep. So... All of, the, uh, all of the pulleys are moving just fine. Uh, the alternator pulley, moving great. Uh, the tensioner pulley, also moving great. The water pump pulley, even though it's melted, it's still moving well. Mm -hmm. um, the air compressor pulley is the only one that's not working, right? Yes, yeah. Um, so the reason the, and, and I think what the, what the deal with the, uh, the water pump is, I think the belt just got so hot because it was really making a lot of smoke and everything like that once uh, something seized up. I'm guessing it's the air compressor pulley, um, that it just melted the plastic pulley of the water pump. Um, so I don't think there's anything wrong with the water pump pulley except for that it's melted. So I don't think that it's <laughs> so like there's something very wrong. With I don't it. think that like yeah the, the it's like seized up on the inside or anything like that. I don't think there's a problem with the water pump. Yeah, I don't um, think so. Because to our little bit of uh, knowledge and research that we just did, um, the air compressor pulley should spin freely at all times unless the air conditioner is actually engaged. Obviously, right now with the air conditioner off and the entire motor off, um, the the pulley should just spin freely, uh, from what we understand. So yeah. that's what we think we're going to do a little bit more, a uh, little bit more digging and all that kind of stuff. And if you guys have, uh, have anything to say about this, um, just let us know. Also, uh, if you know anything about like, if, um, if you could just replace the pulley of the compressor, yeah. uh, that would, that would be really helpful. Uh, rather not replace the whole compressor if we could just replace the pulley. Uh, not sure if that's a thing or not, but we're going to look into that. Uh, but we're going to crowdsource this uh, this troubleshoot session. So, is that it? Yeah, I think so. Okay, thanks for any help.